Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to this Fleet Europe uh, podcast, where we will focus specifically on re-marketing. And we're happy to have today with us Wolfgang Reinhold, Chairman of CARA, and Ian Wright, Specialist in Coaching and Training on Used Cars. So Wolfgang, specifically for you, a welcome. And I would like to address uh, first a question to you. Because in June, uh, in June, on the 22nd of June, there's a remarketing expert track where CARA is founding a partner. Uh, and this remarketing expert track is a half day free access online event. And it'll be all focused on the topic of online retailing. Now, CARA has been supporting this as from the start as well last year and the remarketing expert track that we did at the start of the uh, year as well. So why is CARA so focused on supporting the uh, the uh, industry here? First of all, thank you for having me in the podcast. Why is CARA so active? We were founded about seven years ago and in one of the Fleet Europe uh, associated days, uh, we discussed that car remarketing is a little bit on the back tail of the industry. And then we started and we have created the Car Europe. We are the representatives of the European used car sales, not only for leasing companies, we are for service partners, for auction houses, for rental car companies, and we have quite a good and a nice footprint for international European uh, companies, which have the European car remarketing activity in one way or the other. And therefore, I think that is quite important uh, uh, to push that uh, forward especially in the last couple of uh, months, we went through a diff difficult and different times. A lot of things had changed and a lot of things will change. And that is why we want to push this into the industry, into the market, um, and uh, that everybody can benefit from that. Okay, great. Now, I see that most of the recent or one of the new initiatives that I've seen is CARA uh, Academy. So is this another stage in supporting the uh, industry, your uh, members or the industry overall? First of all, what we promised to our members that we have some sort, we call it deliverables, that we are starting. One of the first deliverables, for example, was the fair wear and tear uh, reporting guideline for the industry, which we are doing now already the version and the new word is uh, 2.0 where we do an update during uh, 2021 in after the summer. And a quite important thing is when we were sitting together and said, what is important? I think what is important is training of our people. You don't have a real training program for European car remarketing experts. Uh, you have a lot of local initiatives, but as the market is going more and more Europe or across border, I think it is important uh, that we really try to train people on all different kind of tools. And therefore, I'm more than happy uh, to uh, welcome Ian, who is on the podcast today. He's the expert, and he helped us a lot over the last couple of months or nearly a year ago to really create these uh, activities. And I think, uh, Johan, if you take that over, and Ian can give us much more information about uh, the academy. So Ian, uh, indeed, Welcome again. Um, what is the general setup of this CARA, uh, CARA Academy? Because you were there at the uh, start, I believe. Uh, indeed, I was, uh, Johan, and thank you for the warm welcome. Um, yeah, we've put together what we feel are the key principles to uh, come up with a compelling and strong offer, both for CARA members and non-members. Um, obviously, the pandemic over the last 12 months has meant that uh, we've had to look at coaching and training quite differently, uh, with a major shift, obviously, towards online. Um, so all of these courses will be uh, uh, offered as an online uh, presentation. Um, again, with people working from home and a different culture towards working, we've limited the sessions to a half day, so it accommodates people's timing much more readily. Um, the sessions themselves, one of the things that we've learned, uh, if you like, as a training body is that uh, you've got to make sure that they're interactive, that the delegates are kept engaged through a series of exercises, either individual exercises or group exercises, um, using polls, uh, just to ensure that they come away with the learnings that we obviously want to impart to them. Um, we're only going to use, obviously, experienced trainers that have got industry background 
uh, in the specific topics, which ensures that they're able to obviously handle the delegates' questions, uh, you know, at, at the highest level, but also that the uh, sessions themselves then are absolutely engaging and that the outcome is, is where we'd want it to be from a, a learning methodology. Um, and the other great thing, and one of the things I've been excited about in terms of being involved in this from the outset is there's a vast array of information that we can draw from the CARA members and their respective businesses. So we've been able to incorporate that within a lot of the training sessions that we've put together. Um, and the final thing to say is, of course, with CARA being a non-profit uh, organization is, uh, you know, the courses are accessible for everybody um, and very competitively priced. So it's um, expert uh, content provided by expert at a very accessible entry, which then uh, creates a way that people yeah, have a lot of added value and don't stay away from their work for uh, too long, actually. So that seems to be a very compelling offer. Now, what different sessions are available in the uh, scope of this? Well, when we put the prospectus together, Johan, um, we, we created in, in excess of 20 sessions. However, where we want to start with this is effectively a fast track program. Um, we see it as three core areas of the business. So we focused on the B2B, business to business, business to customer, B2C, uh, and ultimately, obviously, in residual values. Um, the, the, the fast track system will effectively accommodate swift learning for all of those three areas, um, but preceded by an introduction to the uh, remarketing world. So everyone will basically go through an induction program that enlightens them about what they're going to, uh, if you like, have a vision with, and then they can uh, tailor their learning specifically through one of the three tracks. Okay, great. So uh, maybe coming back to you, uh, Wolfgang, what are the uh, steps that will follow or how can people enroll or how will it work further? Yeah, that uh, real life came back to us. We had a little bit delay on the IT side, on the website, on the techniques, but we are 99.7% ready. I hope the uh, rollout will come uh, next week or the week after. That's quite important that everybody inside and outside of CARA can read what we are doing. Uh, there is a, a registration tool which you can use on the different sessions, as Ian said before. Uh, we are starting this year with the fast track. Um, even you can do payment uh, over, the, uh, over the tool. Uh, we have given a special discount, of course, first to the car members, but then we have special prices as well when you book three courses to the non car members. Uh, that's quite important. And um, we hope that uh, people will register pretty soon. We are starting after the summer. We decided not to go through June, July because summer period. And I hope in Estoril that we can give the first feedback uh, on the first training courses, how it went and uh, make a little bit more propaganda that we are getting more and more people in. As Ian said rightly, we are a non-profit organization. And I think the pricing is more than fair to members and uh, non cara members. And you can see and follow that up on the CARA Europe Academy on the website, as well as we will have a couple of uh, LinkedIn information. And of course, we will give a little bit more information on the 22nd of June, when we have the next uh, CARA Marketing Expert track. Okay, thank you. Well, there's a lot more news coming from Fleet Europe indeed on re-marketing. In April, May and June, we'll have a few other a series of uh, podcasts we will have another remarketing expert track on the 22nd of june which again is an online free access uh, half day event and that'll be all focused on online retailing there's another expert track coming in september and uh, the remarketing forum in no november and indeed as we all hope that this can be in real life again in estoril so a lot to look forward to Ian Wolfgang, thanks for your uh, input and see you at one of our next occasions.